All right, guys, doing a little video this morning. Not a whole lot of progress on the paint booth. We got a, I guess it's called a header panel, I don't know. Built on the top there. Reinforced this corner a little bit. This is one of the doors. Got a window in the middle of it and a filter down at the bottom. Uh, the boys are coming back Saturday, or at least Don is. He'll get back on it and hopefully he'll get that finished. Got the race car out. Thought I'd shoot you a couple pictures of it. Uh, unburied it. Let me see something here. There we go. This reflection in the clear. Uh, Got to do a little maintenance on it before we fire it up. Let's get the bowls off the carburetor. Uh, just give you a quick walk around. That's a joker there holding the bowl of kryptonite. The name of the car is uh, My Kryptonite. There we go. Zoom out a little bit. I suck at the camera thing. I'm getting the hang of it though. Starting to learn. Uh -huh. There's a couple inside shots. Uh, the blue box is a nitrous timer, which isn't on the car right now. And uh, the brown box is a delay box, which is uh, set up for uh, bracket racing. You want to use the top bulb to go off of instead of leaving off the green or the bottom yellow. This is a CO2 setup for the clutch. Uh, it's got a ram on the clutch pedal. It holds the clutch pedal down, and uh, the delay box releases the ram or the solenoid on the CO2 system and releases the clutch. Uh, you can release there. You can adjust the speed that the ram comes back. Uh, so if you want to slip the clutch a little bit in each gear, it works a little like the uh, old Washington anti shockers and. Uh, it's a little more consistent because air pressure usually doesn't vary with temperature, so. Uh, like I said, we took the carburetor part this morning. I made a video. For some reason, it didn't come out right, so. I 86 that one. Uh, we got the bowls off. We're going to check the condition of the floats. Uh, looking for trash. This is 750 Holly, standard, standard. Uh, got the top that I cut off of it. Nothing really special. Uh, we're just going to make sure there's nothing in the jets. It ran a little crappy last time I started it up. The weather's getting a little cooler here, so we'll probably have to step the jet size up a little bit. I'm going to run a power valve in this. It's straight jet. Well, we got to clean the oil filter, the Oberg system on it. We'll jack it up and do that and uh, charge the battery a little bit, put some gas in it, and we'll fire it up. Let's do this short video so you can check it out. Uh, we got the Nova back in the hole there. Takes a lot less room up back there. Uh, probably this, make this corner the Chevrolet corner. This is the back side of the wall. Eventually just drywall that out, I guess. We're gonna get the Cadillac in here. We got the shop all cleaned out. It's one good thing. Uh, we get this convertible pushed out. I just got done uh, giving that thing a bath out there. So we'll pull that in and do some white diamond. We'll turn the water off real quick. Here's where all the mess from the garage went on the back porch. So I have to buy a shed or something, but uh, this is all the over clutter. Too good to throw out, but got to do something with it. Good morning, Lulu. How are we doing this morning? Say hi to everybody on YouTube. Got a little progress on the back room. Second coat of mud. The 
This is uh, Billy's doing this, the guy with the bus, trading out some carburetors. And uh, hopefully this will be done for Christmas this year, this room. This is the fireplace room, one right by the pool. When we moved here, I had uh, really thin paneling on it, so I took all that down, put drywall up. So, work in progress. So we got a couple of the big block parts soaking in the acid over there and at the bottom end soaking in here. Uh, I think we're going to put that thing together. It's going to do like a 9 to 1 compression motor or something I can cruise. Uh, really enjoyed that video that Slow SRT put up. I mean, as well wife, even though they had some bad luck, it looked like, you know, they're enjoying the car. And, uh, Usually when you got a drag car, I mean, not that you don't enjoy it, but uh, you get a lot more mileage out of something that's uh, not so radical. Uh, I don't know if we can go with a hydraulic roller in this or we'll have to go with a flat tappet out to see what the requirements are for spring pressure. But I know I originally set those heads up for a flat tappet cam, so. Uh, We'll have to check it out. This car is mostly steel. A lot of you guys, uh, this car's been 9, what, 962 last time out. Uh, a lot of metal. So, when I was uh, younger, my biggest, uh, I loved Betts and Perkins and all those cars, all those pan cars that started this crazy turbo stuff. Uh, we had a customer at the shop I worked at and he bought a turbo kit, I guess back in the early 90s before it was popular. And uh, had an ARPM case with a set of uh, Clydeberg heads. And I don't even think it was Clydeberg back then. It was probably Gene or Fumio. But I know they were really set a nice set of heads on there and it was a big motor. It was a 86 millimeter crank by 94 which was huge back then and uh that thing would run 1090s on the street man just scare the crap out of you and uh i fell in love with turbo cars there's the oberg down there uh i don't know if you can see it we'll get the car jacked up and uh, get that out or actually just unbolt it and clean the screen that uh traps particles down to about three microns so uh, you can check the condition of the motor, uh, see if there's any bearing material or anything going on with the engine. It's a, it's a pretty cool system. Uh, that's about it. We'll uh, download this video real quick. Uh, we'll go to the parts store, get some carb cleaner, get the Oberg clean, put some gas in it and fire this thing up. So. You right. having fun battling with Verizon? My phone works. I won, as usual. Andrea's been trying to get an $843 credit for two months, and they uh, shut her phone off this morning. She's not very happy, but her phone works again, so she's won another battle yet. Um, I'm Let going me turn to this off. 